Curtis Wilson, Vice President, General Manager, Travel Entertainment within the Global Merchant and Network Services Group for American Express. What I would say is using QR codes and kiosks, especially for quick service restaurants, streamlines the customer experience. This allows the customer um, the ability to pay more quickly and more often. And it helps restaurants flip tables more quickly. Uh, again, diners spend less time waiting for a menu, waiting for a place to place their order, and waiting to pay. This higher turnover allows restaurants to serve more customers when they're seated for dining. Using QR codes and kiosks also help increase takeout orders in a similar fashion for customers wishing to enjoy their order at home. First, I would say this, embracing technology will help automate the back of the house um, and make it more of a smoother process. The other thing I would say is that in addition to using mobile apps, web-based ordering, it's important to make sure that you're embracing these technologies with your customer facing experience. I mean, what that allows you to do is have digitized solutions for both your marketing, your contact information, how you uh, provision your menu and ongoing updates you may want to communicate to your customers uh, like specials, hours of operation, um, new menu items. Um, so everyone should consider digitizing to show that um, customers have a better process and, and payment outflow uh, through, you know, you can do mobile, mobile ordering, mobile perks, reward programs, all through a digitized format, which benefits the restaurateur and their customers. We actually launched a backing of historical small restaurants um, where we looked at 25 historic and culturally significant restaurants around the U.S. And they'll be chosen and they will receive a $40,000 grant. And we'll be announcing these 25 historic restaurants in May. So we're really proud of that. Uh, we've always been a part of the restaurant industry uh, and we both benefit from it. Uh, these grants will help improve and upgrade and preserve the physical, physical space uh, of these restaurants. Um, and hopefully mitigate any existing operational operational costs that they've incurred uh, during this time frame. And of course, we always support our small businesses through Small Business Saturday, which is something we do in November of each year. Um, it founded in 2010, and we've actually seen seen over the last 10 years 140 billion in spend across 11 Small Business Saturdays combined. So we support small business and we support our small business restaurants as well. Thank you.